and in Florida, they give the Cubans asylum because of this. Because they yeah, 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 if they got which wild, is interesting because huh? now and, and then they vote against. Uh, yeah, let's. Well, it, well, it's interesting <laughs> because we're actually really. The, I'm not. It's not completely analogous to the issue, issue that we're seeing right now, but we're very skeptical i think of taking in people from countries at least as a uh citizenry um we're very skeptical of like when like somebody from china comes here we're immediately like why the fuck are you here from china you're a spy <laughs> <laughs> which which again we 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 advertise yeah. as come here and, well, and, 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 and by the way <laughs> and you get here also, by the like, way i'm not why? saying i'm not saying that, that we think of like this as the chinese but i'm thinking like when you uh, see uh, stories it's, it's everyone when it's, you see when you see these stories online of uh you know like illegal immigrant gets caught and uh chinese immigrant we're like why the fuck are you here from china and why just china's a long trip like well, like, like south america well, i understand like going across water if we believe well this is my thing if we believe that if we believe that we have the best quality of life in the world well then that might be why they're here but, oh yeah and how, i agree well, this is how i'm trying to this is this is how i'm trying to make this make sense is that with cubans Yes, they if they are able to hit Miami Beach, then they are U.S. citizens right off the rip. So us as a country, we recognize you may want to escape that regime and whatever the fuck. Um, so why don't we think the same way about like like I said when like Chinese get here? Why aren't we thinking that they're trying to get away from away China? from communism? Why do we immediately thing, yeah. think that they're like a asset or some shit to that country because rather than movies? being like, yo, I need to get the fuck up out of here? Movies. I mean, I don't, yeah, I don't see yeah, that many movies of Chinese no, spies. No, a, a lot of times your Asian dude is is is, is a tech, or yeah, I, I, or man. knows karate, knows karate, and they're yeah, dangerous that's people. True. That is true. No, no, but but for real, again, I, I always laugh at that and mock that because it's like, yeah, listen, this is what we advertise. Like, yes, if you live in one of those third world countries and you have a country that advertises, come here and there, you have a dream. You can you can become anything you really work hard and want to be. Wouldn't you want to get there too at all costs? Sure. You know, if 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 it's your your kids are either going to be murdered or have to join a gang and then or you can come to America and all it's going to take is, you know, you risking your life and walking across continents and stuff, yeah. go to down, pay somebody eight thousand dollars. And then when it's you, I mean, well, my God, you know, <laughs> it, it's interesting. It, I was watching I was watching a recent pay-per-view uh, shout out to WWE shout out to them. because, Like I said, I'm going to make a channel where I'm talking about wrestling for real. Um, but I was watching a recent pay-per-view that they had in Australia. This kind of makes me think of that because honestly, they damn near had me sold. on moving to Australia. <laughs> like and I, I was wondering if it was part of the WWE's deal to go to Australia, if it's worked in some way that Australia is going to be able to advertise. I'm sure you've seen like on uh like col like uh march madness is coming up so like during the college games you'll see like lsu commercials like move to louisiana it's the best we have the best food everybody's nice here or whatever um yeah so yeah. The, the the sec shows every sec school now it's the greatest <laughs> life ever just come on come to Ole miss we've never been racist <laughs> we're just called the rebels they're just called the rebels it's fun uh it's a heritage not racist <laughs> i love those guys i knew i knew a guy that fucking had that tattooed on his leg that was wild uh but either way not to get the south rise again <laughs> i don't even think he was from the south to be honest i think he was from like pennsylvania real shit okay i'm not even lying i love uh, it god bless america baby by the pennsylvania or delaware like fucking biden and i'm not even bullshit i think they might have been fucking from biden delaware or pennsylvania but either way um uh damn paul you gotta help me out because we're drinking and i'm high um, oh um um oh, wwe australia oh, wwe australia yes Package. i'm wondering i'm Selling wondering the, the life most shit happens here so i wonder if like if you're watching the wwe for example because most of the time they're doing shows here so if you're watching them do one in miami for example are you like constantly getting inundated with like miami's the best fucking don't beaches. move there <laughs> honestly unless you're like, signing prints no if 90% of the pay-per-views are uh, based in America, when you're watching them in, like, the UK, are you guys getting fucking, you know, move to fucking, move to Maryland. Maryland's the best. I mean, Washington, D.C. has so many opportunities. We have crab chips. <laughs> dude, yeah, I, dude, I don't know that. That's a good question. I wonder. Uh, yeah. I mean, yeah. I, I, listen, listen, I always wonder what people think, like, America, and it's like, you ever good and bad? Just like we listen, just like we shit on on places, but but then we look at Ireland, like 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 like, like the wife and I, we we love to look at Ireland, like man, what a what a life. Let's go there and farm. What a beautiful place. man. We know we we, we can go there and do all this, and and, 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 and then, you hear, then you hear people, then you hear people who like 
want to get to America so badly from Ireland. So I'm like, man, we just want to eat more food. We just want like a normal Bro, life. I want to like, man, it's, you know, let me find this Colin Farrell movie. Fucking Banshees of something. <laughs> Dude, it's like Banshees of some fucked up place in Ireland. And I got some roots over there. And uh, I also sometimes will look at it. Um, with a, I'll romanticize it a little bit. It's beautiful. But dude, my fucking ancestors were like, fuck this place. <laughs> dude, they get out of here. They're like, I need to go over there, fucking where they're talking about there's fucking uh, Puerto Rican bitches. <laughs> and they were right. They were right to do that. Uh, the Banshees. So, yeah, this right here of in, sh- this is actually so, okay, look. Oh, I'm not going to spend too much time on this. It got a 96 oh, on Rotten Tomato. I've never heard. What? This movie is dog shit. <laughs> it yeah. got a 96. They love it. I don't go to Critics shit. suck. It was so fucking boring. Critics don't know. They do suck. Y'all don't know shit. Bro, this movie is so... And that's why I'm saying don't move to Ireland. This whole movie was about every single character fucking hating their life, walking around, <laughs> getting drunk as fuck. They go to the they go to the pub. This fucking guy, uh, Brandon Gleason, he literally... His best friends with Colin Farrell. They used to go to the pub and drink Jeez. all the time. And one day he just... This is the whole story, literally. He comes to... Colin Farrell's Spoiler. like, oh, hey, we're vibing. Thank you. We're vibing at the pub. <laughs> Brandon Gleason, he says, shut the fuck up. I am so tired of you talking about fucking nothing all the time. Shut the fuck up. And then he's like, I'm never talking to you again. This is his best friend. And then the whole story is about Colin Farrell then being like, what the fuck, bro? We're best friends. You're supposed to deal friend. with my bullshit. You're supposed to yeah. love me more than anyone loves Literally. Me. And everybody's just miserable there. They just go to the... They, and then that guy, <laughs> Brandon Gleason's like, you're Ed fucking... Ed Sheeran makes, makes oh, the UK sound so good. Okay, nice. Okay, from you know? the UK. Yeah, I was wondering if he was from Ireland, honestly. No, I think he's England. I, oh, uh, Gordon Ramsay, I think, is from Ireland. Hell yeah. I, I think you're probably wrong on that, though. Let's look at We're going to look at that. Maybe. We got to look English. it up. He might, he no, he might be England. Who the fuck am I thinking that's from? Yeah. I need Lauren here. Colin Farrell. Lauren, Lauren always gets me right. She always goes, Paul, no, no, no. It's this guy. Which yeah. usually I'm great at remembering. No, 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 it's this guy. Yeah, I, I'm usually great at remembering yeah. like the most random shit, but in this, if it's not, not a football player, I probably don't remember. Yeah, except that. <laughs> I remember. No. Oh, man, he played at this high school in fucking New Jersey. Co- Colin Farrell's definitely from Ireland. I wonder if Brandon Gleason's is from Ireland. Let's check it out. Probably because this is such an Irish movie. Yeah, he's from. Well, well, you know, Gerard Butler. Look him up. Fuck no, he's not from Ireland. Dude, don't no? you ever talk down on my guy. He's not from Ireland. Man Crush Monday. It. I guarantee it. Scottish. Fucking new. Because and that's what I know. That's pretty close. Though. Okay, because that's close. because that's my my heritage. Oh, you're Scottish. Nice. All right, shout out to Paul. Well, I'm gonna do a 23 me, so we'll find out. Oh, so you don't even fucking know. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> the I, last name comes from Scotland, is what it says on Google. You know. My thing is red I, hair. So, I have you know, a theory. I have to be something. I have a theory. Most people that think that their last name is the actual family that they. Oh wow! They're well, you think I'm fucking? I, I'm not saying you. I'm a I'm a fucking out of the marriage baby. No, I'm not probably. Saying you. I'm not saying you. I'm saying that. Okay, so what are the odds that every single generation of your family never had one grandmother that fucking had some kid out of wedlock or had some kid that some other person ended up raising or whatever the fuck? That my point is is this sim, a similar situation actually happened directly in like my lifetime. My point being is like my dad has a scenario where it's like he was raised by a guy that wasn't his dad, but he didn't have his dad's last name still because he had the last name of <coughs> his mom's first husband. So you see how fucked up that is? You don't even have to understand up, it. So no, yeah, I, you don't even have to I understand it. it. Just understand it's fucked up. So she cheated. No, didn't she? She Her husband died. She, in between relationships, got pregnant with my dad, had this kid, later on met a man, married that man. That man raised my dad. He has the last name of his siblings, which was her previous husband. It has no relation to him aside from that he's related to his kids. Okay, so so she just basically said, Yeah, this is from my well, from, there was from, no dad from, from my deceased husband. There was just, no dad. Well, right, no, yeah. there was no dad in the scenario, so yeah. dad wasn't like a real thing. Yeah, at that yeah, time. yeah. So she's having the kids, she's like, just give him my last yeah, name. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So yeah. give him my last name, but then that last name has no so my just from experiencing this in my time, I'm thinking this is the best fuck <laughs> by the way, also on his birth certificate it has X's. Dude, dude, there was no, fucking... So listen, this is the best record keeping has ever been. <laughs> <laughs> dude, 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 that, that's great. Saying, if you seriously look at the mirror and you think your last name is your last name, I'm like, bro, well, think of a hundred generations. Well, well, let me ask you this. How much do you right. believe in trust genetics and appearance? You know what I mean? Yeah, but that doesn't even tell you the whole story because if it happened with your dad, I'm not saying it even happened no. in your generation. It could be something you have no fucking clue on. No, no, that's fair. I yeah. just know that that 
that, like they're just saying that like like my family, you just know because we all look the exact the exact How do you same. Know? Okay, so this okay, so let me just ask you a plain question then. So we have things like feudalism and things like this that happen, and this is like many, 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 many uh, you know, hundreds of years ago. How do you know that fucking some guy wasn't the richest motherfucker in your area and your dad or your great, 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 from. Many times before that, I believe there Bro, was probably bullshit. You need to watch. Bullshit on bullshit on you bullshit. need to watch more movies where you find a picture that looks just like you from 1848. Okay, and you know yeah. that this is where we could. No, no, for real though. No, but even that no. could have been your half dad, <laughs> and then he could have fucked something man, that, and that you're, really could have came that, back around. Well, well really, like, <laughs> because in this scenario, think if like, okay, think if 18 if, people in a town, how many? Yeah. Hold up. Well, no, my thing, my thing is look at it like this. Think of it if I looked at my dad's brother or some shit and saw some similarities to him. We are related. Half related. I'm telling you. You know what I'm saying? Me and my uncle related, more but, like than my dad. But but as far as a but as far as like a last name standpoint, we have the exact same last name, so on and so forth. But like I said, we're half related. Yeah, so no. his dad is not the he, my dad got named after his dad. Yeah. You no, no, you're right. 100 percent I just like to bullshit. But, well, no, but, it's just it's interesting. But 23 me, hopefully, you know, the, the, the DNA thing at least the breaks DNA, it down. I believe that the DNA thing could be solid. And then don't be wrong. You could end up like finding some shit after that. Again, listen, listen. Me and my uh, everyone <laughs> sees me and go, "Are you Steve's son?" I go, "Come on, that's yeah, my uncle." Yeah. Sure. And, and my dad is ten months apart. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I I look more like him. I mean, I look like just a heavier, bearded, long hair version of him. Yeah. And my dad, no. Hmm. But uh, I'm not even saying any shit like that. But no, you know I, mean, I mean, my my mom. My, who the my, fuck knows what you were? My told, biological bro. mom. Who know? I mean, who knows what you weren't told? My thing is, this is this is it. So the guy that Sorry, my daddy's my daddy. The guy that raised and we're gonna get off this because like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't personal. know what we're doing. This but is too personal, but I think it's, it's fun. interesting. Yeah, it's I think a, it's interesting. It's fun. His dad, the guy that raised him, he was told his entire life that was his biological dad. That's fun, and that he didn't have his last name because of the same reason that he wasn't there. Actually, they fucking <laughs> tried his ass. Imagine this shit, bro. You raise a motherfucker that's not your kid. And then they tell that kid the reason you weren't there to see him born was because you were an alcoholic. Okay. Okay, you're not going to. Which was true. Which, no, you're wrong. That was hell? true. That was true that he was an alcoholic, but you don't have to use it against him. But it yeah, wasn't you don't true. Have to fucking pin more bullshit on him and just hammer it at home. Make make him really you resent his fucking father. Him. Holy like, shit! Like Jesus yeah, Christ! That was crazy. That like, was like, crazy. Like he resented him for being an alcoholic and then resented him for being a liar. No, Bamba was wild. Like Bamba was wild. She's well, a beautiful see, woman. No, 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 no. Now yeah. that's some shit. That, like I don't believe. Violent. Don't lie to your well, kids about shit like that. Then, like, like that shit comes back. But then, like I said, bigger point. Even being back. even being than that is that this guy's so that story, but is not even his father at all. Right. So then, so how do you take the news? The 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 truth. Rough, rough. See, sure. Like now, like, if they would have been real with him since he was a child, and the like, kids are, which you, which you have a young child, and you, yeah, yeah. and you see it, they're oh, much dude. smarter than anyone wants to give him credit for. Dude, they really yeah. understand life. Yeah, they so, understand what you want to see. Yeah, him. my kid was showing me pictures. She's like, she's, he's gonna like this. She right. wanted, she wanted, and she wanted the applause for it. She right. knew what was she. So, she was expecting. Yes, they, you know, they, they, they have a conscience. It worked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so be honest. Yeah. And then at the end of the day, like like I say this all the time. Uh, if if the other parent is a shithead, don't talk shit about it to 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 your kid. Just okay, yeah, all right. Just and let then, them. Just and let them one day, th themselves yeah, one day they're gonna be like you know at twelve, thirteen, and they're gonna look at their other parent and go, "You're such a piece of shit." Yeah, and really and really feel it now. And then you got to be there for that emotional support. <laughs> but my god, like like you can't because because they're gonna resent you more for for making for thinking oh, that, yeah. that that like you made me think negatively. Yeah, it's yeah. like no. So it's oh, like, no, man, sure. just let them learn. Man, listen, hey, kids, let them trust them. Hey, I'll be honest. In be my, real about who their parents are. And and, <laughs> and I got another sister. I don't you, look like my if dad. If you happen to be out there watching this, I have another sister, and she has a, a dad who's wild. I, I didn't see much from my mom as far as, like, like talking about aside from like you know in moments but like for being conscious to not like down talk so i think I, i'm agreeing with you not to down talk and then she i think has a 
from what I can tell, a decent relationship with her dad, but also, like you said, has an understanding, had the same experience, had a similar experience, right. had understands, you understands know, exactly why. Yeah, explicitly told like, hey, he's this or that or this or that. You know, she had her experience and she came to a whatever conclusion she came to, which is you know her choice, her life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great. So, I think it's a great liberalism. Point liberalism let's do it <laughs> guys cease fire cease fire all right so real topics guys cease fire for real so on, so, stop shooting each other. so we agree with with uh